Good day everyone. Here's our math challenge for today. And here's our question. This is from International Mathematical Olympiad long list. Now solve for the value of x given the equation 4 raised to x plus 6 raised to x equals 9 raised to x wherein x is a real number. Now if you want to try this problem, just pause this video. We have 20 seconds and timer starts now. Time's up. Now let's answer this question together. Now our goal here is to solve for the value of x given this equation. We have 4 raised to x plus 6 raised to x equals 9 raised to x. Now to answer this question, let's play around a little bit. Now what will happen if we divide all terms by 4 raised to x? Now notice that 4 raised to x over 4 raised to x is just 1. Now at this point, let's use some loss of exponent. If we have a raised to n over b raised to n, we have different bases but same exponent. It is equivalent to the quantity a over b raised to the power of n. Therefore, this term 6 raised to x over 4 raised to x can be written as 6 over 4 raised to x. Now, 6 over 4 is just 3 over 2. Now at this point, notice that 9 is just 3 raised to 2, and 4 is just 2 raised to 2. Now at this point, we will use again some loss of exponent. If we have b raised to n raised to the power of m, it is equivalent to b raised to n times m. Thus, this 3 squared raised to x can be written as 3 raised to 2x, and this 2 squared raised to x can be written as 2 raised to 2x. Now, let's apply the first property. Therefore, the right-hand side of our equation is equivalent to 3 over 2 raised to 2x. Next, let's apply the second property. Therefore, the right-hand side of our equation can be written as 3 over 2 raised to x raised to 2. Now, to make it simple, let y be equal to 3 over 2 raised to the power of x. Therefore, this term becomes y, and the right-hand side becomes y squared. Now, let's equate this equation to 0. So we have 0 equals y squared minus y minus 1. This equation is familiar because this will give us the golden ratio. Because if we solve this using quadratic formula, we get the value of 1 plus or minus square root of 5 all over 2. And that exactly, <clears throat> and this is exactly the golden ratio. Now, we know that y equals 1 plus or minus square root of 5 over 2. And we know that y is just 3 over 2 raised to x. Now, let's focus on this term. We have 3 over 2 raised to x. This is what we call an exponential function. And the graph of this exponential function looks like this. Now as you can see, the range of this function is all real numbers greater than 0. Therefore, the value of 3 over 2 raised to x cannot be a negative number. Thus, we need to consider the positive part of this answer. So we have 3 over 2 raised to x must be equal to 1 plus square root of 5 over 2. Now let's focus on this equation. Now our goal here is to solve for the value of x. Now take note that if we have an exponential equation b raised to n equals a, it can be converted into logarithmic equation n equals logarithm of a to the base of b. Therefore, this exponential equation can be written as x equals logarithm of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 to the base of 3 over 2. And this value is approximately equal to 1.1868.
Therefore, the value of x in the equation 4 raised to x plus 6 raised to x equals 9 raised to x must be logarithm of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 to the base of 3 over 2. And as always, we are done.